Hello, welcome to watch this video. And from the beginning, uh, there is a news uh, for the AliExpress anniversary sale. There are two days left. Uh, please notice the time. If you have something in your wish list, uh, do not miss this chance. Okay, uh, some week ago, uh, I make a video to tell you that RT 6012 and RT 6018 has new firmware and you just need to connect the device to PC via micro USB cable and use the PC software to update the firmware. There are two customers who failed when updating the firmware. Uh, even when they enter the boot mode, the update uh, stuck. Uh, we follow the guidance to check and we do not find anything wrong. Uh, until one customer uh, tell us that he removes the Wi-Fi board. He removes the Wi-Fi board uh, on the back and uh, he is able to update the firmware successfully. Uh, so we share it to another customer. Uh, he finished the update too. Uh, so I do not know uh, the relationship between the Wi-Fi board and the firmware update via USB mode. Uh, you can have a try if you meet the same problem. Okay, so this is the problem of the firmware update with the Wi-Fi board. Another question is about the DPS series power supply, uh, power, power board for DPS 5020 and 5015. Uh, there is a separate uh, power board. On the board, you can see there is a fan power socket. Some customers want to add an extra fan uh, in parallel on this socket. It is not suitable because for this power socket, it can only power on the fan. It cannot provide extra power to other um, models like uh, fan or other things. Uh, please notice that. Okay, if you have any questions, just contact us and we will make a video to show you what problem we made and how to solve the problem. Have a good weekend.